These new Flex 24 volt tools are sure to shake up the power tool industry. We'll talk about the details when we get back. I'm Tim Johnson. You're watching Shop Tool Reviews. Let me say that this is a very early look at these new power tools from Flex. We've had them now for a couple of weeks, but Flex actually asked us to kind of keep it under wraps until their launch event on Monday, April 12th. It's called the Face Off Event. Go to flexpowertools.com. You can sign up to see that, see all the brand new tools they're coming out with. There's more than just the ones that we have here. However, some things got leaked through Lowe's and through some other people. And so they said, hey, you know what? You can talk about some of the stuff, but don't show performance, don't show specs, don't talk about the details. So that's what I'm doing. So if you're watching this and it's before April 12th, we're probably not gonna have a lot of content here. However, if it's after, after April 12th, we're gonna have links to each one of the reviews for each one of these tools so you can see the specs, see how well they performed and so forth. Now, with that said, let's take a closer look at each one of these tools that we have here and then we'll come back and wrap this up. Let's start with the battery technology. You see here we have a 12 amp hour battery right in front of us. So, and we have everything here from a two and a half amp hour battery to a five amp hour battery, eight amp hour battery here, and a full 12 amp hour battery here. Uh, should be able to run some things for days with this beast. Uh, one of the nice things on here is being able to easily see the charge life you have on the battery there with that bright LED light and that's on either side of the battery. Now with their chargers as well, they communicate very well with their chargers and their batteries. We have a rapid charger here that is 280 watts and we have a fast charger here that is 160 watts. So we're gonna be able to charge a lot faster with the rapid charger, but still be able to get some work done with the fast charger as well. Also, there's a lot of cool features when it comes to chargers and batteries uh, when it comes to flex because they know how to keep these things cool while still charging these very, very fast. We have the half inch high torque impact wrench. Now this guy's got multiple speeds as well as an auto mode. Uh, and then you get your typical, you know, slide directional forward and reverse um, and variable speed trigger. And again, I don't want to get into too many specs here, but we have nice rubber over molding on all these pistol grips that have a very uh, uh, aggressive uh, feel to them, but they're still soft enough. It feels comfortable to the hand, but doesn't feel like it's going to slip out of your hand. We have an LED shop light here. Now, one of the things I really like about it is you can just tell it's built very rugged. So pretty much got a roll cage all the way around it. Uh, and that full 12 amp hour battery will fit in here. So that should be able to run for a long time. And we have multiple modes on this as well. We'll get into that later. The reciprocating saw. This guy is gonna be fun to use. Be fun to do some demo work. Uh, you get an orbit mode right here, easily change that from straight to orbit. Uh, you also get um, tool-free uh, shoe adjustment as well as tool-free blade changes on here. Uh, rafter hook on it as well and a trigger lock. This is the turbo hammer drill. By the way, all these tools are brushless tools, but this is the turbo hammer drill. So we get a turbo mode in it, a little more power, a little more power boost, uh, as well as you get a, a drill mode. Um, driver mode for driving screws, as well as hammer mode for your uh, hammer drilling into concrete and so forth. Uh, you get a true steel Jacobs chuck on here as well. I love to see that on a drill. Nice components on this drill and uh, two speeds as well. So easily change from one speed to the next right there on top of the tool. Then we have the quarter inch impact driver. Now this guy, there's a couple of different impact drivers from Flex. Uh, but this guy has got not only multiple speeds, but it's got a couple of auto modes as well. It's also got a couple of really cool features that we'll be talking about as we review this. And again, as I mentioned, all their pistol grip uh, rubber over molding is very nice and aggressive as well. And finally, we have a four and a half inch angle grinder. Paddle switch, I love a paddle switch on a grinder. Some like a slide lock, I'm a paddle switch kind of guy. Also, we have some speeds down here on the bottom. Don't see that a lot when you're looking at the angle grinder. So glad to see that. Looking forward to testing and reviewing all these tools, bringing it back to you guys and gals. Flex Power Tools is not new to the power tool world. They've been around a long time. In fact, the parent company has been around for even longer in developing battery technology, charger technology, and even tool components 
for others as well. Now they do very, very well in communicating between their chargers and their batteries to keep things cool while they're charging as well as to be able to charge them fast. And then the same way in being able to communicate from the tool to the battery. Again, I won't get into too many details there, but I just wanted to mention that Flex is not new to this game. Now the 24 volt lineup is a brand new tool line. Now we've still got the Flex uh, German side, which is the 18 volt tools, a lot of your automotive uh, auto detailing stuff, even some uh, concrete polishing, things like that. We're not sure if those are gonna transition over to the 24 volt, but for right now, those are the you know dark red tools that are 18 volts. These are gonna be the new black and gray 24 volt line that you can buy exclusively at Lowe's for right now. Now prices, warranties, things like that, we will talk about after the launch event. Be sure to check out the launch event. Again, it's on April 12th, that's a Monday, and it's at 5 p.m. Pacific time, 8 p.m. Eastern. Join that with us, we'll be watching. We're excited about these new, new tools. Do they perform well? I think you know the answer to that, but again, I'm gonna keep my mouth shut for now. Be sure to follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. If you don't mind, would you hit that like and subscribe button, but only if you liked our video. If you hated our video, give us that thumbs down, but would you let us know in the comments why? Hey, hope to see you on Monday. Have a great day and keep smiling.